My name is Charu Sharma and I work as a senior engineer at Cisco. I do application design development and also I'm, uh, I focus a lot on uh, writing applications on Cassandra, and data modeling and everything that relates to uh, application development from a Cassandra perspective. You know, initially during the, uh, you know, the, the database evaluation uh, phases, right, uh, we started off with Apache Cassandra and then this was, I think, sometime back in 2014 or 15, uh, you know, there was this conference that DataStax had held. I think that was one of the early conferences that we had. And, you know, everybody in our team, because we were experimenting with Cassandra, we said, okay, let's just go ahead and uh, you know, see what DataStax has to offer. And then, yeah, one thing led to the other and that's that's how we discovered uh, DataStax and Cassandra. Commerce is a very big revenue generation, uh, revenue generating system for Cisco, right? So we cannot go open source on a database, right? We need to have support. And uh, I think there is no other, um, uh, you know, vendor in the market who is distributing Cassandra. I think DataStax is the uh, only one. And uh, the choice of Cassandra as a data database was, you know, mostly driven by the fact that we wanted an active, active uh, database that works in multi uh, data centers. And also, you know, it offers you linear scalability, resiliency, fault tolerance, you know, all of that, which is needed uh, to work in a cloud native environment. You know, whenever we have any uh, issues with our cluster, right, I think the DataStax support is very uh, prompt, right? So we get good support uh, from there. So that way it is, uh, it is helpful. I think 100% uptime, right? Like this has been a very uh, big win for us because, you know, if you go back to our uh, legacy system uh, in Cisco, uh, you know, every quarter we used to have these quarterly releases, right? And, uh, you know, the entire system was brought down and the releases used to happen in the weekend, right? So now, uh, you know, that, that model, we don't follow that model uh, anymore. And all of this happens without any downtime. Ever since we went live, uh, you know, with the new system, we've not had a downtime. We've had a very smooth experience working with DataStax, be it with the support team or with, uh, you know, the architects for some very complex problems. Uh, so they're very helpful and, uh, you know, you can always reach out to them. I mean, I think you, the first thing you need to get right is the data model. And once you figure that out, I think everything else uh, is pretty smooth.